Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix disk write error with Counter Strike 2 game on Steam. So if you are unable to install or update the game, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to allow the game exe file to your antivirus program. Now if you have already installed the game and while updating, if you are receiving the error, in that case, you can allow the game exe file to your antivirus program. Now for this, uh, if you have any third party antivirus like Avast, Norton, Bitdefender, McAfee, whichever antivirus program you have, you can allow the game exe file to your antivirus program. Now if you're using Windows security, you can open Windows settings. And then if you have Windows 11, click on privacy and security. In Windows 10, you will have an option update and security. So click on update and security in Windows 10. In Windows 11, click on privacy and security. Now click on Windows security. Now click on virus and threat protection. Now, if you are unable to install the game, you have not installed the game, you are unable to install the game. In that case, for some time, you can turn off this virus and threat protection. So you can turn this off, download it. Once you install the game, now you can always enable this. Enable this, all these, once you have installed the game. Now, similarly, if you have any third party antivirus, you can disable your th third party antivirus till the time you are downloading the game. Once you're done downloading the game, you can always enable it once again. Now, if the game is already installed while updating, you are facing this problem. Now, under virus and threat protection, you can go to ransomware protection. Click on manage ransomware protection. Now, click on allow an app through control folder access. And then click on yes to allow. Now, click on add an allowed app. Now, click on browse all apps. And then go to the game installation folder. So, if the game is installed in C drive, open uh, C drive. And then open program files x86 now open the steam folder steam apps folder now open the common folder over here you will find the game folder in my case it's in different right so open steam library folder then open the steam apps common and then open the game folder and then bin folder win64 select this exe file now click on open now once the game is added and then Type in control panel in Windows search box and then click on control panel. Now click on system and security, Windows Defender Firewall. Now click on allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall. Click on change settings, click on allow another app, browse and again select this exe file, click on open, click on add. In my case, it's already added. So once it is added, now you can click on OK and then now you can try to update the game or install the game. Now. The next step is to run Steam as an administrator. So close Steam. If the Steam is open, close Steam. Now once Steam is closed, type in Steam in Windows search box and then make a right click on Steam and then click on run as administrator and then check. Now the next step is to uncheck read only on the Steam folder. So go to the Steam folder. So go to C drive and then open program file 686 now over here you can see the steam folder make a right click on steam folder then select properties and uncheck the option which says read only and then click on apply click on ok and once done now click on ok and then now try to install or update the game still you're facing the problem then in that case clear download cache now for this go to steam and then click on settings go to downloads and over here you can see the option which is clear download cache click on clear cache and once that is done now you can try to install or update the game next step is to verify the game files so make a right click on the game select properties go to install files and then click on verify integrity of game files after the verification try to install or update the game next step is to allow steam full control on windows after that verify the game file now to allow the steam to full control uh, allow full control for steam in that case again go to steam folder this pc c drive program files x86 steam make a right click and then select properties and go to security tab and then click on edit now put a check on full control and then click on ok you have to select your username first so make sure that you select your user over here and then click on allow and then for full control, click on allow and then click on OK and then click on apply, click on OK and then check. Still you're facing the problem, then go to properties once again, security tab, go to advanced option over here, click on advanced and then click on change over here and over here type in everyone. 
and then put a check on check names and then click on OK and then put a check on the box which says replace owner on subcontainers and objects. Now click on apply and then click on OK. Let the process complete then click on OK. OK again make a right click and then select properties and then go to the security advanced. Now click on add over here add and then click on select a principal not type in everyone over here and then put a check on check names click on check names and then click on OK and now click on full control click on OK apply OK OK now you can open steam and then try to install or update the game make sure that you have to restart steam after this now the next and after this you have to verify the game file now if we make a right click select properties and then go to install files then click on verify integrity of game files after the verification try to update or install the game next step is to go to settings steam settings click on steam then go to settings now go to storage now select the drive if the game is installed in c drive if you are trying to install in in c drive select c drive if you are trying to install in some other drive select other drive now click on these three dots and then click on repair library click on repair library and once that is done now you can try to install or update now the next step is to uninstall and reinstall the game to different drive so if nothing is working you can make a right click then select manage then click on uninstall now after the uninstall go to the game installation folder delete the game folder restart the computer and then if you have another drive try to install the game to different drive so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix the disk write error with counter strike 2 game on a windows computer so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel